Good morning children. Welcome to today's EVS class. Myself Kabita Shri here. Today we are going to start the 6th chapter Omana's journey. At the end of this lesson you will be able to know about a train journey. You will be able to know about different people working in the railway station and make a list of different items sold in the railway station. This is the picture of two little girls of your age, Omana and Radha. They are staying in Gujarat. They are very happy. Do you know why? They are happy because Omana and Radha's family have planned a trip to Kerala. Omana's family was going to her grandmother's house in Kerala and Radha's family was going for a holiday trip to Kerala. Do you know how they are going there? They are going by train. So Omana and Radha are very excited about their train journey. This is the map of India. Omana and Radha are going from Gujarat to Kerala. Gujarat is a state on the west and Kerala is a state at the south. Omana's father had booked the tickets for both the families. This is a picture of a train ticket. A train ticket has two important numbers, PNR number and the train number. PNR number stands for passenger name record. It gives the journey details of a passenger. But unfortunately, just two days before the journey, Radha fell down from bicycle and fractured her legs. Radha's leg was put in plaster for six weeks. Do you know what is plaster? Plaster is a bandage with a hard covering. The plaster allows broken bones in the arm or leg to heal by holding them in place. Plaster is usually put for 4 to 12 weeks. Radha's family had to cancel the tickets. Omana and Radha were very sad. But Radha's mother suggested that Omana should write the details of her journey in a diary so that when she comes back, Radha can read the diary and know about the journey details of Omana. Omana agreed to this. So children, we will know more about Omana's journey in our next class. Today, you try to answer these questions. Number 1. Fill in the blanks. Part A. Omana is going to her dash house. B. Omana's grandmother's house is in Dash. Part C. Omana's father booked train tickets from Dash to Dash. Question number 2. What is PNR number? Question number 3. What do you mean by plaster on hands or legs? Children, write down these answers in your notebook and learn the answers with their spellings. That's all in today's class. Thank you. Good morning children. Welcome to today's EVS class. We are doing the 6th chapter Omana's journey. In our previous class we have learned that Omana was going to Kerala to her grandmother's house in train with her family. This is Omana's family who are ready to go to Kerala. She is going with mother, father and brother. Omana reached railway station. She could see a very busy railway station with so many people and trains. She could see two types of trains, passenger train and goods train. Passenger train carry the people and goods train carry the goods. She could see the ticket counter or reservation center. People buy their tickets from the ticket counter or reservation center. Omana's father had already booked the tickets, so they did not buy the tickets. 
they directly went and checked the reservation chart. Reservation chart shows the list of all passengers of a train. This is the railway platform. Platform is a place in a railway station where people wait for their train to arrive. There are many shops in the railway platform also, like book and magazine shops, stationery items, food stalls, etc. Omana could see a coolie. A coolie is a person who helps people by carrying their luggage. She also observed the railway police. Railway police looks after the safety and security of the people. Omana's train arrived. It is a passenger train and a passenger train has maximum of 24 coaches. Omana and her family stepped inside the coach of the passenger train. When they went inside, the TTE, train ticket examiner, came and checked their tickets. TTE wears a black uniform. When they went inside, they could see the seats of the train. A seat of a train is called a berth. Berths are of different types. Lower berth, middle berth, upper berth and side lower berth. Look here the picture of the berth of the train. This is the picture of the side berth. As Omana had promised to her friend Radha that she will write all the details of her journey on her diary, she took out her diary and started to write all her experiences in her diary. So children, in today's class you have learned what are the things Omana saw in the railway station. Today, try to answer these questions. What do you mean by the following terms? Reservation chart, platform, birth. Question number two. What is the full form of TTE? What does a TTE do? Question number three. What is the work done by the following people? Kuli, railway police. Write down these answers in your notebook and learn the answers with their spellings. That's all in today's class. Thank you. Good morning children. Welcome to today's EVS class. We are doing the 6th chapter Omana's journey. In our previous classes, you have learned that Omana, a little girl from Gujarat, is going to Kerala to her grandmother's house. She is going with her family by train. Omana is very excited about her train journey. She is noting down all the details of her journey in her diary. The targeted learning outcomes of this chapter are to know about a train journey, to know about different people working in the railway station, to know about different items sold in the railway station, to know about different states of India. The competences that will be covered here are observation, identification and discovery of facts. It is lunch time. Omana is hungry. Omana's mother has packed different food items in their tiffin box. Let's see what is there for lunch. Look at the picture of Dhokla. Dhokla is a popular food item of Gujarat. Next is lemon rice. Lemon rice is very popular in South India. There were some sweets also in Omana's tiffin box. Omana's family had their lunch. After lunch, most of the people in the train felt asleep. But Omana did not sleep. She was looking through the window. Omana could see the green fields, the dry lands, 
and the beautiful scenery of sunset. In sunset, the sky looked orange. Omana had never seen such a beautiful scene before in Ahmedabad. On the way, the train stopped for few minutes in Valsar station in Gujarat. Omana could see people selling different food items in the platform like tea, puri, chaat, batata vada, cold milk, etc. Do you know what is batata vada? Batata vada are vada made of potatoes. It is very famous in Maharashtra. Omana's family also bought some fruits like banana and chiku through the window of the train. Omana could see the cleaning staff of the railways. They were cleaning the train and the platform of the railway station. She could also see a person waving a green flag. He is the railway guard. A railway guard is a person who gives signal to start a train. He waves a green flag when the train is ready to start. In the train, there were two other children of Omana's age. Omana made friendship with them. They shared story books with her. Children, do you know what are the activities children do in train to pass their time? Yes, they read books. They play indoor games like Ludo, chess. They solve puzzles, Rubik dice, etc. What do you do when you go for a long journey? Make a list of all those activities that you do when you go for a long journey. Also, make a list of all the things that you carry with you for your journey. This is the picture of the train bathroom. Omana went to the bathroom to brush her teeth. But... There was no water in the train at that time. A person told that it will be filled only in the next big station. Children, can you guess why there was no water? Yes, it is because people waste water by keeping the taps open. All of us know that water is very precious. We should never waste water. Children, with this we come to an end of chapter 6, Omana's journey. We will learn about the rest of the journey of Omana in the next chapter 7 and 8. Today, write down the answers of these questions. Question number 1. Fill in the blanks. Part A. Dhokla is a popular food item of the state dash. Part B. Batata vara is made of dash. Question number two. How do children pass their time in a long train journey? Question number three. Who is a railway guard? What does he do? Children, today I am going to send a link in Google form for class test of chapter six. It carries 20 marks and all questions are multiple choice questions. Write down today's assignment in your notebook and learn the answers with their spellings. That's all in today's class. Thank you.